Well, hello, YouTubers. How are you guys doing? For today's review, as many of y'all know, I love these old Ford Super Duty trucks, and I always try and film them whenever they come across my path. And today, I bring you this 2003 Ford F350 Lariat. This will be a complete and end up review the F350. We'll start the engine and show it off and go over many of the performance specs and show you many of the features and add-ons that this truck has to offer. So we'll again start off by walking around the exterior. This truck has the two-tone bright red and be Arizona beige on the bottom. Like I said, this truck is a 2003. It's kind of hard to tell just by looking at it because it has the 2005 to 2007 front end and bumper and grill. Also the headlights as well. So it looks like it's a newer truck when it's really an 03. It also has this front brush guard mounted on it. It also has the 05 to 07 style badges. And even the 03 to 07 tow mirrors with the marker lights built in. It's got black faced 18 inch wheel, XD series wheels, wrapped in Nitto Terra Grappler tires. It's got N Fab running boards on the side. And this obviously is a crew cab. It is a long bed, by the way. Has the newer FX4 badges on the sides. If you look inside the bed, it does have a spray in bed liner. Has seen better days, but it's gotten a lot of use out of it. And as you can see, the tailgate right here is the newer 2008 to present style tailgate. Also, the tail lights are, are the 2008 to present. Also, it does have a aftermarket rear bumper. I believe this might be by Ranch Hand, but correct me if I'm wrong. It does have a tow package down there. Factory exhaust. Now, pretty much showed you all around the exterior of this truck. Now we're going to go on the interior. It does have its original remote keyless entry system. The key is not original. It's got color match door handles. Inside, it does have the have a tan leather interior. All your power options are up here. The power windows, window locks, power door locks, and power mirrors. So, now let's go ahead and jump inside here. It does have WeatherTech floor mats. Fantastic truck. Now we're going to start the engine. This truck has 351,000 miles on its odometer. Very high mileage, but it shows you that how reliable these 7.3s are. So, now let's go ahead and start this thing. Awesome. It's got a full leather wrapped steering wheel. Very smooth power steering, especially for a truck this big. These 7.3 trucks have a Ford 4R100 four-speed automatic transmission with low gear selection and overdrive selected by the button on the shifter stock. All right, so now we're going to turn on the lights. It does have automatic lights, fog lights, and the hazards. The driver's window is automatic down. All right, now let's go and check out the exterior. Gonna give you a sound of the exhaust. This truck is a very nice sound. All right, now it's gonna go back inside, shut off all the lights, and now I'm gonna pop the hood. 
and show the engine. At the business end of this F-350, we find here it's 7.3 liter power stroke turbo diesel V8, 16 valve engine, produces 250 horsepower and 525 foot-pounds of torque. 2003 was the final production year for the 7.3 before they moved on to the 6.0s. It does have a Duralite air filter on the side. It has the original turbo down there. This truck runs fantastic. You can't beat these old 7.3s. Now for fuel economy, these 7.3s were definitely not known to get good fuel economy, but you can get an average of 15 or 16 miles per gallon depending on your towing and driving characteristics. So, let's go ahead and shut the hood. Now we'll go back inside. And now we'll go ahead and see how it sounds. Awesome sounding engine. The parking brake's located right down here. Just press to set, and the indicator light shows right up there in the dash. And then pull this lever here to release. All right, so now we'll go ahead and shut the door, roll up the window, check out some of the interior features. It does have an aftermarket Sony CD player right here. It does work great. Right here's your source control, your shuffle, your mode, track seek, and tune. Turn it off right here. There's your CD deck right behind. Six presets down here. Auxiliary line in and USB port right over here. Your climate controls right down here. Your fan speeds right over there temperature and your different zones front defrost max AC right there's your fold-out cup holders storage pocket right underneath here's the remote for the deck right down here you have two aftermarket gauges that monitor your water temperature and your trans oil temperature right here's your 12 volt power point you have another one up here Center console storage that does flip up for the extra person riding along with you. You do have storage inside. Love box. Two storage pockets on the side of the door. Visors with vanity mirrors. Sunglass holder up above here. The heads up display is not working and the buttons are missing. Your cruise controls located on the front of your steering wheel. Wiper controls are on the turn signal stock. It does have a tilt steering wheel. Power sliding and tilting driver's seat. Manual recline and manual lumbar support. All right, now we're going to show you in the back seat. You have to go around the other side. You have a very good amount of room in the back seat. I'm 6'5 in height, and this is how much room I have back here. There's another view of your dash. You have two reading lights up above. It also does have LED interior lights, as you can see right there when I open up the door. There's your reading lights back here. Two flip down armrests with two cup holders. Storage behind the seat. There's the other LED interior light. The seat does fold down for extra cargo space. You do have two Rockford Fosgate subwoofers mounted back there.
right here is a Reese brake controller. Overall, this is just a fantastic truck. I'll go ahead and shut it down here. Well guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this in-depth review of the 2003 Ford F-350 Lariat. Please like, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.